take over in this case and uh, maybe not allow something to be built, but it seems to me that a university might be able to go out, purchase an area of land, and instead of trying to put students in those homes as they exist, they're going to try to tear it down and build something bigger, uh, which may not be suitable for the area, but I would assume local zoning would take care of that, so I just kind of wanted to bring that to the, to the attention. Now, the, the biggest part of this bill, and I will be brief, uh, is, is the effect with respect to the hospitals. Um, ladies and gentlemen, we talk a lot about care and patient access to care. Um, we're serving an aging community, and as one of the colleagues just mentioned a moment ago, we don't all have hospitals in our district, but we all have patients. And one of the things that's happening is we're moving to the accountable care organization, and we're trying to find ways to put more access to care in the community. This bill will not allow hospitals to grow. So they're not going to have the opportunity to go out and put in those other entities where they need to treat patients in our community. And then they turn around and put you know, the equipment in that needs to be done, they're not going to be able to do it. So to me, this is going to inhibit access to care. So I cannot support it. Thank you.